M0 FXP Digital Ham Radio Diary. Welcome. M0 FXP, welcome to my channel, ICOM 7100. Quick look at the manual and the RTTY settings. So we're on, I think we're on page 74. Let's have a quick look here. We've got the radio in the background and we haven't used this yet. We're just reading it and trying it out on the radio. So RTTY set mode uh, settings in the RTTY mode, push menu C one or more times. So we're going to hit RTTY at the top to get us into RTTY. Now, if you did it twice, it goes into RTTY re reverse. So we're in RTTY and then we're going to hit the menu button here and go to menu number two and at the bottom here on the screen it says decode. So we've hit decode and if we want we can make that wider. There you are. Now obviously look up the frequencies that you're going to be using, the correct frequencies for RTTY and you can actually do this with a program on your PC but we're just looking at what we can do on the radio. So design, you know, select the desired band. So we're on 20 meters. So you just tap the screen, select the band. And if you want to change the frequency, you obviously turn the VFO or put direct input if you want by holding. Now that's the step. So you tap the screen and then look, you can enter the frequency then. Uh, hold to change the step, yeah, which is a handy tip as well. So let's go back into menu two, like so, menu two, back into RTTY, menu two, and then decode, okay, and you can make it wide, which looks quite snazzy, doesn't it? So reading down through, uh, it looks like you do have a sort of set screen, so on menu button here, menu, you got menu one, two and three there's rtty and you've got a, some set settings here twin peak i mean i i haven't used them so but there's the settings there uh you can see and on the on the screen here of the manual you can see different settings there let's keep going rtty decoder so we've already selected decode Looks good, doesn't it? I'll have to uh, wait for an RTTY competition. So I'll put the link for this manual. This is the advanced manual. And there's quite a lot here with the settings. You've got hold, clear the characters. Appears when the hold function is on. You get a little H there. Wide. Now, you, there are presets in it, setting the decoder threshold. Have a good look at that, the preamp. Look at the settings on the manual there. I'm interested in the presets, RTTY decode set. There you are, menu, menu number two. So let's try menu number two. And you can actually edit different things, so go edit and you can edit presets that are in there. Looking through. We're quite a lot transmitting an RTTY memory, an RTTY mode, push menu once to menu two. Touch decode to display the RTT recorder, decoder, touch Y, touch. How do we TX? Touch one of the memory keys, here it is. So touch to select memory groups. Touch the RTMD, RTTY memory screen, which is this, no. So when you're in decode, you can now touch RTM on the screen. And then you've got these items here, RT1, 2, 3, and 4. So if we touch one, our power is, let's get it right low, because I'm not sure I've got a great SWR. Let's touch one, it should TX RTTY. Let's try it. Yeah, can't hear any. I can't hear anything, but it's TXing RTTY. That's pretty handy, isn't it? 
So let me know if you ever if you've ever done this and have a go. I'm sure you can do it on the 705. Editing, you can edit them. We just seen that, didn't we, in the other menu? It's not really my thing, but turning on RTTY decode log. So there's a log there as well. Decode log set mode. And then we're on to AMFM. Let's just push these menus again. So if you tap the screen, you've got menu two to edit. See that? And you tap the thing and you can now edit. Hold your finger on it and edit. Go back, log. So decode log on or off. Let's turn it on. So you tap the screen, you've got one, two menus. Then you've obviously got your main menus here. So get it to the right frequency. And then you've got these two lines on the screen, which I'm guessing you've got to line up with the peaks of the RTTY signal. So you need to know uh, which is FT8 and which is RTTY. So look in the, the, the band plan, get the exact frequencies for RTTY. So I'm just showing you that it can be done and it does it quite well by the looks of it on the ICOM 7100. So thanks for watching my channel. Hope this helps you to use RTTY on the 7100. Bye for now. All the best.